Hi folks, Jeff here from Twin City Roofing and Remodeling, your home exterior construction specialist. You're thinking about replacing the windows in your home. Today I'm going to give you the basics. So, let's talk about it. So folks, when it comes to window basics, I'd like to start off with the frame first. As you can see on my far right here, this is a wood window. And from this point to this point is the actual frame of that window. Here, the middle window, which is our composite window, which means it's made out of fiberglass, very strong and durable product, this is the frame of that window. And then finally, with our vinyl window here on my right, the frame is this distance from this distance. So we can see here with our vinyl window, we're actually seeing a cross cut, which shows the individual chambers that comprise the frame of the vinyl window. And then inside the topmost chamber here is the glass pack that sits inside that chamber. And here this black uh, tape product, it's actually called butyl tape, is what helps to seal the glass pack to the frame of the window. And then finally, the manufacturers will apply an inert gas inside of the glass chamber, which then helps to give the window U-value, or what we call an insulation factor. These components, whether it's the butyl tape that helps to seal the frame to the glass, or the inert gas that's applied in between the double panes of the glass, helps to provide the window with greater thermal resistance, thereby protecting your home against this region's harsh winter environment. So as we've covered the basics of this vinyl window and the other two windows as well, is we have the frame and the glass pack and the seal between the frame and the glass pack. Our middle window here, which is our composite window, helps to bridge the, the void between the historic traditional wood window and the emergence of the vinyl windows about 30 years ago. We're seeing a strong trend towards composite windows. Composite windows, like our vinyl window, is a maintenance-free window. And what do I mean by that? Well, a wood window is stained and it has lacquer on it. And no matter what, because of our harsh climate here, we get condensation that builds up on the windows. And with a wood window, over time, the lacquer and the staining becomes tarnished. And as a result of that, it's not considered to be maintenance-free. Whereas the composite window and the vinyl window are both considered to be maintenance-free you eliminate the hassle factor of ever having to re-varnish or restain the window. Not to mention the fact that both of these are rot-free windows. So that once they're installed and installed properly with proper flashing and taping, you can be confident that these windows are going to perform long term for your home. Another important factor to consider when you're weighing the options for what kind of windows are price points. You know, price points can be a big factor because um, all of these windows can have a number of features that are added to them, like built-in blinds or beefed up what they call glass packs. Um, and, and depending on what kind of style of window, whether you have the classic crank out or what they call a casement window, or if you have double hungs, these features and these factors can all play into the expense of the window. I can indicate to you that you know, vinyl windows are considered to be more budget friendly than wood windows and in between the two of them are the composite windows. So again, the vinyl window would be the least expensive window as a whole. Then the next most expensive window would be our composite windows and then finally the most expensive window would be the wood window. You can find out more about all of these products on our website at TwinCityRoofing.com. When you're considering new windows for your home, Twin City Roofing offers a number of financing packages, including an 18-month interest-free. Check us out on our website at TwinCityRoofing.com. And remember, we are home exterior experts so that you don't have to be.